Hi, I'm Todd Cooperider with Esoteric and welcome to our FAQ series. Today's question is about vinyl wrap. You know, when should I do vinyl versus PPF? Or if I'm doing like a blackout package, when should I do vinyl versus uh, having something painted? First things first, let me talk about like a full car wrap. You know, a lot of people like changing colors or changing up a, a look, or maybe they want to take their car and do a stealth look. They've got a black car, they want a, a matte black uh, finish, and they're gonna look at having vinyl done versus a satin PPF uh, install. And one of the mistakes a lot of people make is they look at the cost, that, that upfront cost that you have, and the vinyl wrap is a little less expensive than what uh, a PPF is gonna be. And they think, well, that's the one for me. Well, there's a couple of trade-offs that you get with that. One, it's not giving you protection uh, on the car like PPF. PPF is far greater uh, and PPF is far more durable. And the vinyl wrap after a couple years is gonna start showing a considerable amount of wear. Now, the next thing that comes up that nobody talks about is the removal and the removal cost involved with vinyl wrap. We just had a car in here recently, a couple weeks ago, Audi TT that was a, a complete color change vinyl wrap. Then to do the removal, it literally took us 24 man hours of labor to remove that. So $100 an hour, that's $2,400 wrapped up on top of the cost of the initial. So you're not comparing apples to apples if you just look at the install cost of vinyl versus PPF. PPF, you know, you may have three or four hours involved in the removal, whereas on the, the vinyl, you have a tremendous amount of labor and cost that goes along with it. Now, the other uh, side of vinyl is when we're talking about like blackout packages. Let's say you've got a Mercedes E63S uh, that, that you wanna change out or you wanna finish out the look of it. You got a couple of different options. You can have that stuff wrapped in vinyl, uh, typically, people are going to go with blackout. You go with a, a gloss black or a satin black uh, on there. So you can go with vinyl and do that, or you can have them painted. Now, when you have them painted, it's obviously more permanent. You can't just easily go back to what you had before like you can with vinyl. But the finish quality looks much, much better. Uh, it's far more durable, and it has more of a factory look. Whereas when you go in and you do it with vinyl, it has a you know, modified or, or temporary uh, look to it. Vinyls today are getting much, much better. They look fantastic, but nothing compares to what you can do with painting. And when you're talking about emblems and such, you simply can't wrap that in vinyl. It has to be painted. Yeah, and if you're talking about complete disassembly of uh, the vehicle, you know, to, to do most of these wraps, you have to take all the stuff apart. You're taking mirrors, you're taking door handles, you're taking window trim, you're taking all these things uh, apart. That's gonna be the same whether you're painting or whether you're doing vinyl. And the painting doesn't cost that much more than doing vinyl in most cases, and it looks a lot better. Now you wanna see some examples of this, Check out the next video here. We did a complete blackout package on a uh, brand new AMG E63S Mercedes. Looks phenomenal. Enjoy that video.